The cold wave, which is approaching South China's Guangdong province, is said to be the strongest in three decades. It will bring heavy rainfall and below zero temperatures to some parts of the region. In the provincial capital Guangzhou, relief stations have been prepared to provide shelter for the homeless. He Weiwei reports. Wednesday night, staff at the Guangzhou relief stations came out to the street to provide hot congee to homeless people and introduce them to the shelter stations. The next day, staff was busy recording information to identify those that came. At lunch, hot food was distributed for free. <laughs> Among these people, some are disabled, while others are having temporary difficulties. I had some cabbage and beef for lunch. I'm a migrant worker. I lost all my money, so I had to come here for help. I hope they can buy me a ticket back home as soon as possible. The station is capable of providing shelters for about 300 people at the same time, and now you can see that it has already received a dozen of people here. And in the coming days, the station is prepared to provide shelters for more homeless people as the cold wave approaches. Males and females are separated into two areas. Our newcomers can get coats and clothes for free, as the temperature is predicted to drop continuously. To cope with the cold weather, we prepared all the necessities to keep them warm. Hot water is also available 24 hours a day for drinking or for a shower. We also provide three hot meals per day. There are six relief stations in Guangzhou with a total capacity of 1,500 people. During the coming days, staff and volunteers will continue patrolling the city's major streets around the clock to provide necessary help for the homeless. He Weiwei, CCTV, Guangzhou.